it's still in there, but it kind of goes down, um, gotcha, gotcha, you know, down yeah. the, the priority list a little bit more. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, and then in terms of like pricing, you know, um, you know, we're, yeah, I mean, I'll share you numbers. I mean, if, if it's something like, you know, mm -hmm. if, if you remember the webinar, the lead generation funnel, you know, mm -hmm. that's typically where I start. Like, we've got to get investors in your database. Like, if there's yeah. no investors, who are you reaching out to, right? Yeah. Like, you need them in your database. So something like that, you know, we're usually about five grand to build out the flow and the funnel, write all the narrative, write all the emails, build it all out, uh, basically. Uh, mm -hmm. And then it's a, it's usually about $2 per lead. So let's theoretically say 500 investors show up into your newsletter after, you know, a month and a half. You know, at mm -hmm. the end of the month, we'd invoice you for two bucks per. Um, you know, or what we do is we say, you know, is there something we want these people to download, right? Do you want to have them download your pitch deck, right? Or, or yeah. you know, basically it's because nobody is going to go to a WeFunder campaign without knowing who you are and invest a bunch of money, right? It's just like, no, nope, nobody mm -hmm. does that, right? It's, I've got to learn who you are. I've got to experience it. I got to have multiple touch points. I got to mm -hmm. feel safe in the investment. Also, you have to educate people on what WeFunder even is. Majority of people don't, they don't, they've never been on it. 